What's up, everyone? Seven Star Mike here for Trade Talk Media, bringing you this week's flow review. If you want to join us to be able to take these trades live with us, there's a link in the description below. And if you guys are not finding trades to take using Black Box, you're just not paying attention. There was so much action this week that this is going to be a lightning round. Let's go check out the flow. All right, we're going to start with TJX. This is on Tuesday. We saw the 319 250 calls coming in. There's a lot of action early on, and then this $442,000 sweep, and then a little bit after that. The numbers after that aren't super exciting. They're 25,000, 39,000, 27,000. If you guys have listened to me talk before, we're not interested in these little trades. But we had a little bit of action in the morning and almost a half a million dollar sweep followed up with some smaller trades i like this one i'm in it it's currently down but i don't care about it because we have out to march and there's some decent money going into this overall that one came in tuesday also tuesday was spce we have these three five forty dollar calls now we have four hundred seventy three thousand dollar ask side sweep 101,000, 120, 129, 180, 302,000. So decent dollar amounts going into these. This one was trading at $38, $39 in that range when these came in. And look at this, it made it all the way up to $58. That is a pretty good trade. That's the type of stuff we're looking for. Lots of money going into it. And then it happened to spike the next day. That one was a nice one. PLUG, $1.55 million sweep. After that, 244, 713, 604, 616, 327, 319, 242. So good dollar amounts going into this one each time. This one's actually down a little bit now, but that's the type of stuff we're looking for. When we see them hit it for multiple hundreds of thousands at a time, and there's a million plus sweep mixed in there, that's good looking flow. Not all of it's gonna work out, but that's the type of stuff we're looking for, and those are the trades we're gonna take every time. MITT, this one was on the unusual scanner for us. Now what's cool about this one is they started coming in at 18 cents, 20 cents, 25, 30, 35, 40. Where does it stop? 45, 50, scroll up to the top, this hits 75 cents. They started coming in down here at 20 and 25 and it hits 75 the same day. That's the type of stuff we're looking for, good returns on those types of trades. NKLA, this one was Tuesday also, so we saw some good action on Tuesday. Look at this, million dollar sweep. Before that, we had a $389,000 sweep. So good dollar amounts going into that. Where did this one go up to? $29. The spot price at the time was 22 and 24, and then it hit a high of 29. Good dollar amounts going into that, good gains on that trade. BBBY, this one was Tuesday also, so a lot of action on Tuesday. We have 156,000, 170, 190, 242, 128, 37,000, don't care much about that one, but 131. So when you see hundreds of thousands at a time going into it, that's pretty good looking stuff. The spot price was 30, 37, 31, 24. It hit 32, 30. Where does it go on the charts? Up to $50 over here. In pre-market action on this day, it hit up to upwards of 51 plus, 51, 55, almost $52 from a spot of 32. That's the type of stuff we're looking for. Multiple hundreds of thousands of dollars at a time in an aggressive manner. And that one made a nice $20 move from where this flow came in. WKHS, this was again on Tuesday, 118,000, 100,000, 346, 156. So some good money going into there. Same thing on this one. The spot price was 27, 28, 31. Look what it did over here. It made a high of about $40, just under $40 from a spot price of 30 and 31. Square, this one came in Thursday. We have $12 million above the ask sweep. There's some 600, some 700, some 400s, 500s, and an $8.5 million sweep. So when you have this much money going into a ticker, you have got to pay attention to what's going on. Spot price, 209, 215, 217, 218. Look what happens on the chart. In some pre-market action, it hit 226. So even over here in regular action day, 222, 
So from 215, 217 to 222, that's a pretty good looking trade right there. You can't ignore 12 million and 18 million dollar sweeps and it expires 618. So there's plenty of time on this one still. Moving along, TSN, this one was also Thursday. 100 plus thousand, 100 plus, 100 plus, 100 plus, 400, 300, 862,000 above the ask sweep. These numbers are grabbing our attention. Boom, $3.49 million block. That's the type of stuff we're looking for. This one expires out to 416, plenty of time on it. So we're not worried about what it does between now and when we bought it. It's got plenty of time. So if it dips, no problem. And did it? It did. Spot price 127, currently 121. But when you see this kind of money going into a trade, we're not worried if it drops. It was way up here at 127, so it's down a little bit from there, but there's plenty of time on it, and there's a lot of money flowing into this one to back us up. Next up, FTCH. This one was Thursday also. $1.43 million sweep, followed up with the $325,000 block. This one was trading at about the $60 range. It's still there now. So not much movement on it yet, but again, expiring 416. So if you get into a trade and you have three or four months of time on it, you don't really care what it does the day you got it, the next day, two days later, there's three or four months of time for this trade to work out, let it play out. But $1.43 million ask side sweep came in Thursday. Then Friday, we have two trades on Friday. LVS was the first one. We have the two nineteen forty seven dollars calls, $955,000 sweep, $2.42 million block, one fifty five. dollars So some good money going into that. This was currently trading at $48.06. After hours, it's $48.50, so not a lot of movement, but guess what? We just got into this one not expecting a huge same day move. If it comes, great, but if it doesn't, let the trade play out. Someone put a decent amount of money into this one. We're just gonna follow them and see what it does. Also on Friday, we had WBA. These were the 319.57.50 calls. So there's a $400,000 block surrounded by some smaller dollar amounts here and there. This one was called out on CNBC also. So that's one of the things we like. When we're in these trades early and then it's called out on CNBC, there's usually a little bit of a bump there and then we see some follow-up action coming through. These were trading at around low $50 and it's still there now. It dipped a little bit in after hours, not worried about it. They're out to 319, a lot of action on it here, some decent money going in with the CNBC call out. That's the type of stuff we're looking for. We see this information live on on black box stocks. If you guys can't find these trades on your own, join us on the chat rooms. There's multiple chat rooms. We have Discord, and then over here, there's a chat room as well. I'm in that chat room during the day, bell to bell. On Discord, we have other moderators pointing this stuff out. If you guys are having trouble finding these trades, join us in the chat room because you're not trading alone with Black Box. So next week, we're looking for some exciting stuff. We've got some ERs. We've got this GameStop stuff going on. So exciting stuff coming up. We're gonna be watching the markets. We're gonna be watching flow and let's go find some trades.